Bro, actually, uh, I'm in class 10th right now. Hmm. And uh, I have no clue what uh, what should I take, you know, for my 11th and 12th and eventually for my career. And I see all my friends, they have already decided to do engineering, to do doctor, to do UPSC. Karna hai. And I'm like fully confused ki kya karna hai. none of these are like, you know, so, something that's really of my passion. Hmm. I mean, there's a voice which is telling me that uh, I'm not going to take a conventional career. But then I'm the, as good as clueless only. And in a few months, I'll have to give my boats which will be followed by like you know me choosing science or commerce and i'm fully confused what to do okay uh, good yeah. good question sit how many 15 year olds do we have here? 15 or younger okay cool okay first of all bro you need to understand one thing which is that no 15 year old really knows what he's doing the parents have like told them that listen i think it'll be better if you do this so i think this is what you should do and then they're listening to the parents coming to school and say ha main yahi karega okay it's actually the parents who are talking through them that's one thing. A lot of times, as 14, 15 year olds, you think you'll do one thing and then you actually get out into the college world and then you realize, wait, it's not my thing. A lot of people switch their streams in college, okay? That's firstly what you need to understand. So if your friends know what they are doing, doesn't mean that they are correct. They might be completely wrong. And they're talking out of innocence, all of them. No matter how smart you are as a 15 year old, you haven't seen the world right now. You've only seen your school. Okay, that's one thing you need to understand, which is difficult to understand as a 15 year old. Because you think you're the oldest kid in your school, so you perceive yourself as mature. All these college kids, when they're looking at you, they're looking at you as like a kid. Okay, that's how 10 standard students are perceived because you all haven't really seen the college world. That's one thing you need to remember. Second thing you need to remember is that if you don't know what to do, as bad as it sounds, I believe that you definitely should take science. Okay, and I'm someone who always says that education system is not good, Are you know, engineering is not correct. The moment you take up arts and commerce, you kind of cut off a few of your options. Okay, and it's true. Science will leave your options open. At the same time, if you're very, very bad at science in school, if you're bad at maths, if you're bad at like physics, chemistry, biology, then maybe ask yourself, you know, okay, maybe it's not my thing, but at least take up commerce then. I'm not saying arts is bad or anything, but remember that by taking up commerce, you're cutting off all your science options. By taking up arts, you're cutting off all your commerce and science options. If you take up science, then you can do anything. You can do a science field, you can do a commerce field, you can do an arts field. If you are sure you're going to enter films, if you are sure that you're going to become a CA, then you can narrow down your options to arts or commerce, okay? Can I just add to that? Yeah. And actually, the thing is that, uh, is this true? Like, this is how my parents have told me how the system works. That agar abhi jo decision le ho, that is gonna last for a lifetime, like literally. So now I decide what engineer to be, 10-12 science, uske baad engineering, uske baad lifetime job. Bhai. No, no. I mean, you have to change in the So no, dude, like, um, see, our parents, like, again, Indian parents always look out for our safety. So at every stage, they'll put a lot of pressure on your decisions. Um, they, I, I took up science because of the same thing, I took up engineering because of the same thing, because my parents told me this is correct for you. And engineering taught me a lot. Engineering taught me that, listen, always make your own decisions in life. That's, and that bad engineering experience pushed me into taking up an unconventional career. At, even when I was entering Dear Bicycle and Startups, for two years my parents were telling me you're doing something wrong, okay? Until things started going well. So always learn to think for yourself, but you're just 15. I don't think you should bother about things right now. I do think that if you don't know what you're doing, you should take up science, okay? So don't worry about any other factor. Later, if you realize science is not your thing, engineering is not your thing, you can always change, okay? Don't be afraid of change. Cool? Good luck, good luck. Okay.